Hey, how you doing, YouTube? Uh, this is Bob, once again. If, um, if you want to learn how to draw this photo here, this picture, continue watching, and I guarantee you will come up with a design just as good, if not better, than this. And I'm going to show you how to do it. It's real simple, real easy. Okay, what I'm going to show you is just the basics, okay? I'm going to show you how to come up with that wild looking design. And what you do from it from there is totally up to you. You can shade it in, you can color each line different colors, each section different colors, however you want to do it. I'm just going to show you the basics on how to get it started and what you do from there let your imagination go crazy there's a million trillion different ways that you can make this your own okay I'm just going to show you the basics on how to get it started and um, what you do from there let your imagination go crazy okay let's get started okay you start off with now I'm trying to do this in an awkward position so just kind of bear with me okay you want to start off with a crazy wild wavy line now I'm using a small sheet of paper because this actually does take a lot of time. I'm going to flip it over here so I can finish it out. It's kind of hard to do this one handed. Okay. Okay, you just draw a simple wavy little line like this. Okay. And I promise you my videos will get better. Okay but right now this is what we have to deal with I've got shadows I've got poor lighting matter of fact let me yeah that's a little better okay now on this first bump here okay on this first bump there what you want to do is you want to follow the line up and then when you get to the bottom of this one here you connect it. Can you see how I did that? Then you just do the same thing all the way over. At the bottom you connect it. Okay. And you just do that all the way across. I'm not going to do this video making this whole thing or, or this video would be like an hour long okay so I'll just do this first line and I'm just using a small piece of paper here if you want you can use a bigger piece of paper a smaller piece of paper I, you know I should have taped this down I never thought of that okay I'm gonna flip it around here because I don't have a second hand to do it with And see I messed up there don't pay no attention to that no big deal okay so your first line should look like this where you're over the line here and connected at the bottom okay so I'm going to do a few lines and then come back okay now we've done a few lines and this is what it's starting to look like 
your lines don't have to be all straight you know I'm, I'm trying to rush through this but they just start to grow together and start making that crazy looking design okay it, it takes a little bit of time like I've been working on this for maybe 15 minutes and this is what I've got done so far probably 15 20 minutes and it, they just start coming together and we'll go a little bit further and get back with you okay we're about halfway done with the top part of it and as you can see they just start to kind of grow together okay the small ones get overtaken by the bigger ones it's just just have fun with it and I'm using a black sharpie you can use whatever you want to use you could use a, a um, ink pen you could use a pencil you can use a magic marker you can use a crayon I you know it really don't matter what you use but um, I'm gonna continue on and uh, we'll be back okay here's the top part of it as you can see it's all kind of wavy and squiggly and kind of cool looking now up here I just kind of I'm going to do something different, so I just kind of added some more on the top corner there. So it, you can just let your imagination go crazy with this kind of stuff. You can have the lines do just about anything you want to do. Just manipulate them the way that you want to manipulate them. Now, what we're going to do now is we're going to flip the paper upside down. Okay? Now we're going to do the other part of it. But with this, what we're going to do is instead of connecting at the top or at the bottom and going up, we're going to do the complete opposite. We're going to connect at the top. Wait a minute. Let me, th let me think about this a minute. I'm going to, I just might do something different. I don't know how that would look. I'm debating on doing it the same way. Connecting at the top, or at the bottom, instead of the top. We'll connect at the pop, top. Maybe, maybe we'll do another one later okay so what you want to do is is you want to connect at the top you know what I'm going to do it that way I'm going to connect at the bottom just like I was okay so you just want to do the same thing over again I know the shadows something else it's I, I promise you I, my, my videos will get better right now I'm using a old digital camera that I had it's a it's a good camera you know it's a 10 megapixel but I'm in the process now of getting a 20 megapixel video camera see this in here is just a regular camera and I want to do videos so I'm, I'm in the process now of getting a video camera oh, I'm way over here so I wouldn't even look at and I'll have a tripod better lighting I'm gonna flip it around so I can do this other part okay I guess this might turn out kinda cool you can do it any way you want to do it okay if you want to connect at the uh, other end and just kind of continue the lines down you know you'll, you'll have the lines connect you know the other way ooh crap oh well 
Um, I mean, you can do that, okay? But I'm, I'm trying something different here, which is the great thing about art is, you know, you can do it the way you want to do it, okay? So, uh, I figured I'd talk a little bit while we record here. Um, you guys subscribe to my channel to get more stuff, more ideas, you know. I'm going to do some cooking stuff. I'll do some more art projects. <coughs> Just different stuff like that there. Excuse me. Um... We'll, uh, we'll have a good laugh together. You know, you guys, uh, send me ideas of stuff you want me to try, and I'll try it. You know, I'm, I'm game. I'm kind of up for about anything. Um, I, uh, I learned this little trick from an old art teacher when I was in high school. He was a he was a really good guy, really really nice person. One of my favorite teachers when I was in school. But I didn't have too many favorites. I wasn't I wasn't the best of students. Um, I know that surprises you, but yeah, it's true. I didn't get into bad trouble. I just I got into trouble. You know, I was a I was a teenage boy. I did stupid teenage boy stuff. Uh, I've always had a real good sense of humor. I love to make people laugh. I'm, uh... What you're going to see on these videos is me. You know, I'm not putting on a show for anybody. I'm not trying to, uh... win anybody over. I'm not trying to impress anybody. I'm just... I'm just me. I've got... I'm artistic. I've always been artistic. I've, I've been drawing, sketching, painting, ever since I was old enough to hold a pencil. Okay? I always had something going on. I, I was always doodling on something, drawing on something. You know, we'd, we'd get something in the mail that had little sheets of cardboard in it. I commandeer them and draw pictures on them. Always, always, always been that way. And uh, I thought, you know what? Why not share it? You know, why not help other people enjoy the, the same thing? So I've been kind of thinking up different stuff of, uh, you know, simple little stuff we can do together that you can do whether you're artistic or not. You know, if you can, if you can basically draw a squiggly line, that's what we're going to do. If you, if you can hold a pencil, I'll teach you how to do different stuff. You know, and mind you, I'm no, I'm no professor. I'm not a teacher. Hell, I barely, barely made it through high school. Um. But, you know, if, if, if I could teach you something, fantastic. If you have questions, you know, ask me in the comments, and I'll answer them as best as I can. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm, uh, I've got COPD, and when I get to talking too much, I, uh, I get to coughing. So that's something you want to see quite frequently. So uh, I'm going to quit for a little bit here and uh, I'm going to continue on with the drawing. And if I think of anything else I want to tell you, I'll click it back on. But until then, well, well, here, uh, let me show you, let me finish this, this wave I'm doing here. And uh, I'll show you how it's going to how it looks so far. Okay, I'm halfway. Hold on, hold on, just be patient. <coughs> <coughs> talking too much. If I get to talking too much, I get to coughing. And then my air starts to kind of screw with me. 
But we'll get through it. So I'm going to be one of the YouTubers that don't talk a lot. Okay. Put the cap back on that. And uh, we'll take the camera here. And I know that's kind of a wild ride. But this is how it's looking so far. Okay. I, th I think it's... I think it's going to look kind of cool, kind of waving in together. Okay. Alright, I'm going to take a little break on my voice. And we'll start back here in a couple more minutes. And there we have the finished product. Okay, I guarantee you, you pick up a pencil and you start with that center wavy line, you cannot make a mistake. You cannot screw it up. I guarantee you that. Anybody that can hold a pencil can do this. And I know you can do this. So give it a shot. Give it a try. I'll, uh... Well, I guess I got to come up with some way for you guys to send me stuff that you've done. Um, I don't know. Can you add photos to the comments? I don't know. I'm, I'm not real sure. I've never done anything like that. But uh, if I come up with a way for you to send me your pictures of you doing this, I'll uh, I'll make a little montage with your name on it and I'll put it in my video. Okay. So, there you have it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe so that you can get more projects like this. Uh, give it a like and leave me a comment. See what, tell me what you think of it. I'd really appreciate the, the feedback. Thanks a lot. Bye.